Booyah. Get camera, Chris Terry and I had finished the script for Justice League before this movie came out, right? So that script was done. Movie came out, and some people didn't like the movie. A, sp a, sp a vocal minority. <laughs> and, so, and so I was asked by the studio to like say, hey, you can't, there's a lot of stuff we don't want you to do from that script. So we did a rewrite, right? of the script. So the original Justice League that Chris and I wrote, we didn't even shoot. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of it that we shot, but the actual idea, the hard, hard idea, the scary idea, we never filmed because the studio was like, that's crazy. <laughs> and we were so insecure at the time after this movie came out, we were just like, I guess it is crazy. Like, we're fucking nuts. Like, what are we... There's going to be... There's going to be mass hysteria in the streets if we film this. <laughs> Apparently. It's, Crazy. All right. It's a long story. <laughs> but, but suffice it to say... <laughs> suffice it to say that, like... So, look. The truth is, is that you know, the nightmare sequence in this movie, right, was always my idea that all of that would be eventually explained, of course. I mean, is that a surprise? Um, you know, that we would, and that we would end up in the distant future where Darkseid has taken over Earth and where Superman has succumbed to the anti-life and where he, ha and, and now with his ragtag band. And it was, there was a few members of the Justice League that had survived to that world. in the same position in space, you would jump into space and just be like, dead. And so, okay, so, so there's always like, so they only had, they had two windows, right, to do the jump. And Cyborg says like, what, what, you know, which of these two windows do you think we should use? And Bruce was like, well, what window would you have put me through if you didn't ask? And he's like, this one. And then he's like, use the other one. Because <laughs> that one you already did, and, and it was the wrong one. <laughs> Barry Allen was in my freaking back cave yelling at me about, like, nonsense. <laughs> I'm gonna put him to that other one, because that's the one that will... Because he had to jump right before Dark Side boom tubes into the back cave to murder Lois, so you have to... Oh, Jesus! <laughs> the wind 
know that he had it in life. Anyway. Uh, so I'm just going to say, that right there, he certainly worth another hundred. It's in the future. There you go.